On we go. On we go. Moving on to event number 174. Bishop Lockin of New York, St. Paul Prep of New Jersey, St. Elizabeth Tech of Jamaica, Pappen of Jamaica, Mount Vernon of New York, Belmont Boys of Trinidad and Tobago, Bugatti of Jamaica, Queens Royal, Royal Call of Trinidad and Tobago, St. John's of Bahamas, Garfield of Virginia, and Massanopat of Virginia. Another international field as we see yes. Steths out in front. The Jamaican team, they were fifth at champs. They ran 316-11 to take fifth in the open 4x4. Four four. And they're out to the lead here, but they are not alone. They've got some company from Seton Hall Prep and Bishop Laughlin, although Bishop Laughlin fading a little bit. Steph takes the stick first, but not by much. Seton Hall Prep of New Jersey right there as well. 48-9 for Steph, 49-07 for Seton Hall Prep. St. Elizabeth Tech has never won this event at Penn, but they've got some quality legs, so we will keep an eye on them. We anticipate they will make it through to the final and mix it up with their Jamaican compatriots along with the top teams from the U.S. as well. Look at Laughlin there, but Stets well in control as they round the bend. As to be expected, that St. Elizabeth Tech handling their business. And here we have three teams wide coming around this turn. And handing off in front now, Seton Hall Prep just made a huge statement there. That was a 48-77 split. Bishop Lockman of New York, 48-67, and St. Elizabeth Tech dropped down to a 49-82 split there. Still three teams, all within striking distance of each, of each other. Bishop Lockman now in that all-purple uniform will take control. St. Elizabeth Tech is going to make a move from third to second over Seton Hall Prep. And Stets, we again are not positive of who is running on these legs, but listed we have Jasana Dennis, who has run 45-87. That came earlier this year. So if he is on this anchor leg, then we'll have something special, and it'll take that because they will take the stick in third position just a few seconds back. But if we want to see them in the final, there's going to be some work to do because out in front, Laughlin is taking care of business. 49-3 on that carry. Bishop Laughlin still in the front. Trying to hold on. Seton Hall Prep. Stats trying to make up some room, but it's not going to be enough. They may overcome for second, but look at Bishop Laughlin of New York. They will take the victory. Stats cruising into second now past Seton Hall Prep. But look at this time. 3-14-23. Three fourteen twenty four forty six fifty nine on that anchor leg. What a run from Bishop Laughlin of New York. Yes, and then St. Elizabeth Tech three sixteen eleven anchor went forty six 